Hi, my name is Michael King and I'm welcoming you back for the first segment of the Build a Better Meal program. So in this segment, we're going to introduce you to the five food groups which may be review for many of you. So these five food groups are going to be your veggies, your fruits, your grains, protein, and then dairy. So when you're building out that proper meal, you want to try to get all five of these food groups onto your plate. Now, what about in between meals, those small snacks that keep us from overeating at those larger meals? Well, you want to try to get two or three of these food groups into one of those snacks. So ask yourself, what would be a good snack? An easy one to recommend would be almonds and fruit or yogurt and fruit. Easy to carry around, easy to store. You're also getting the protein and the fat from the yogurt in the nuts. And then you're also getting the carbohydrates and the vitamins and minerals from the fruit. So that is a great snack option. So if you've been into the grocery store without a plan, you can really see how difficult it is to make sure that you buy everything that you mean to and nothing extra. And that's because most of the grocery stores that we go to have over 40,000 items on the shelf. That's pretty incredible. So you think about walking into the store and you just think, oh, I need strawberry jelly. Well, when you walk in and you're looking at the shelf, it's not just one strawberry jelly. You have 12 different varieties, one saying that it's healthy, one saying that it's no sugar, one saying that it's organic. So we have a lot of options within the things that we are trying to purchase. So you want to try to get through the grocery store quickly and efficiently. And the way that you do that is by creating a smart shopping list that's grouped by category. And what I mean by that is that you walk in and you have all of your produce gathered together on the list, then all of your dairy, and then all of your meats, and then all of your aisle items per aisle. And so that's going to allow you to move through that grocery store quickly and efficiently. Next, you want to use those food labels. And so looking at that example of the strawberry jelly, when you have all those 12 varieties of one product and one's claiming to be healthy, one's saying natural sugar, one's saying no sugar, flip that label around and look at that food label. That's your secret decoder ring. It's going to let you know what is actually in that product and if you're getting what you actually think you are. One thing to keep in mind is that every aspect of that grocery store has been researched. Everything from the way that you enter the grocery store to what you see when you first come in, the lighting, the music, it's all been heavily researched to get you to purchase. So you want to be aware of that, that everything as far as placement is getting you to purchase. And they're not necessarily looking out for, are you buying the best thing for you, the most healthy option? It's more about just getting that product across the counter when you check out. So keep that in mind when you walk into the grocery store.